Aloha, I'm Gloria, and I connect. I connect with the depth of your soul, you know, that eternal part of you that loves you like no other and wants always, always what's best for you. And I connect with the celestial kingdom as well as with your deceased. And when I connect, I help you to move through whatever's keeping you stuck, whatever's in your way of you having the life that you yearn to have, you having the life that you know is in alignment and true for who you really are. I find that when I'm helping folks, it isn't their fears or their issues that block them or keep them stuck or keep them feeling bad about who they are or where they're at. It's their judgments of themselves or their issues or their fears. You know what I'm talking about. Those thoughts that make you feel really bad about who you are. Thoughts like, I can't believe I'm doing this again. Or I thought I was past this. Or here I go again. I mean, any thoughts that make you feel less than who you really are, any thoughts that keep you from wanting to grow, those are judgmental thoughts. Now, there is a way to break through that barrier of judgment. It's a simple way. I'm not saying it's easy, but I am saying it's simple. And that simple way is through curiosity. When you're willing to be curious about who you are and what you're going through, you open the way for your growth, for opportunities. You open the way to feel better. You open the way for you, for that life you yearn to live. Now, how do you do that? How do you get curious? First of all, you have to be willing to choose to stop those judgmental thoughts. You have to be willing to put on that pause button. And I would suggest that when you catch yourself in a judgmental thought, and you know because you feel really bad when you're thinking them, when you catch yourself in a thought of judgment, just stop and take in a nice few deep breaths. The kind of breaths I'm talking about are those deep belly breaths where you feel it from your gut and you're breathing in deeply and you're breathing out slowly. You're calming yourself down. You're bringing yourself back to the present moment and you're allowing yourself to open the way to become inquisitive, to open the way to allow curiosity to take the place of your judgmental thoughts. The thoughts that keep you stuck hurt you deeply. And then you, you may find that when you're being hurt by them, you feel as if you're inadequate and you can't move forward. So it's well worth pushing that pause button, button, excuse me, taking those deep breaths and asking yourself some curious questions. Questions such as, I wonder what I can learn from this? Or what need am I trying to fulfill here? Or what can I discover about myself? I'm sure there's more to discover about myself here. If you will allow yourself to ask your questions based on your curiosity, you'll find that an inevitable shift takes place. You'll move from feeling bad about who you are and what you're going through to being curious about who you are and what you're going through. You'll open the way to continue to move forward and to move forward with greater ease and grace and possibly even joy. So please check out the handout that comes with this video. I've written some questions for you so that you can begin practicing asking questions. So you can begin practicing letting go of those judgments that hurt you. I'm so excited to be here with you, and I do appreciate you taking the time out and listening to this video. I will continue making more videos for you, and with each video, my intent is to give you an opportunity to make 
one change at a time, with one step at a time, I know you can do it. I know you can break through your barrier of judgment. I believe in you. And I look forward to talking with you on the next video. And as we say here in Hawaii, aloha. Thank you.